Welcome back to the channel. Now in this video, I'm going to talk about YouTube and how I feel like YouTube is not really YouTube anymore. Now I have always loved sort of the old school style of YouTube videos where it's just a camera and a person and the person talking to the camera and then uploading it to YouTube. That's it, right? Like that's, that's as good as it gets that, that type of content, just camera, person, person talking. It's YouTube for a reason. It's you. YouTube, right? You're watching someone's channel for them and them only. But I feel like now, especially in 2024, that's just not the case at all. YouTube is barely even YouTube anymore. I mean, you barely see people talking to the camera like how YouTube is always supposed to be. It's always just so weird now. Like YouTube is, as a whole, is the, the landscape of YouTube is really, really changed. And it's not really YouTube anymore. It's more like Netflix where you have these like huge scale productions and everything is crazy, crazy editing, hyper editing. And it might be your type of content. Personally, it's not my cup of tea at all. I honestly hate the edited content and you know exactly what I'm talking about. You know exactly the type of content. Retention manipulating videos, which have basically just taken over now because that's how, that's how you gain success. That's how you get the most views. If someone is going to watch this boring video where it's just me and, you know, the camera and I'm talking to the camera, no one's going to watch this. Because the retention literally goes like this. It goes like this, it's starting here, and then goes like that. The drop off in the first 30 seconds of my video is insane. 50 to sometimes 75% of viewers just click off in the first, like, 20 seconds of my videos. And it's honestly substance, like, it's honestly substance abuse. Like, I know it's, that's kind of a weird thing to say but like i honestly think it's substance abuse and the substance that many youtube viewers are you know abusing is the hyper stimulated content and no one wants to watch these types of videos anymore where it's just the camera and the person because it's not hyper stimulating i don't have you know flashy edits or loud noises on the screen it's just me and the camera and this is what youtube was supposed to be in my opinion but now no one's gonna watch this like i get it it's a business and you know people want to make money and stuff i understand that but it's changed everything like re really like the this mindset of you know retention 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 and, and hooking people's attentions just by you know using absolutely like crazy editing hyper stimulating stuff it's not for me not for me at all. I hate, I honestly hate it. I feel like this content is getting, you know, like looked down upon, like, you know, this hyper stimulating content. I feel like more and more people are starting to realize that it's just not it. And that might be because Mr. Beast originated it and now he's in just absolute, he's, his channel is in an absolute mess. His career is in an absolute mess. So that could be a reason as to why people are starting to dislike that type of content. But I hope this type, so, sort of content gets, you know, has a resurgence. I hope that this content starts to get more and more common, more and more people start doing it. Because, I mean, this is YouTube. This is what it's supposed to be. It's just the per a person and a camera. Now we have these absolute massive, you know, productions and the key to success at this point is just to spend more and more money on a video the more money you spend on a video the more views you get the more editing you do on a video the more views you get and i guess it's something that us creators just have to live with but who knows maybe maybe this type of content will come back and i hope it does that's really it that's all i have to say like i'm just throwing this out there in the youtube algorithm maybe it'll get picked up probably not um but you know who knows maybe it will maybe a lot of people watch this video. Also, last thing I want to say, if you've come here from the How I Grew Taller video, which is my most popular video, I am making another one. And this one is going to be way better because, because I actually addressed the core issue of this problem. So keep an eye out for that and I will see you sometime in the future.